Hey everyone, it's Tim Verdau here, and uh, I'm back from vacation. Uh, we've been to the United States. We had a wonderful time over there, but I'm excited to be back doing product reviews again. Uh, and I got the request uh, through email uh, asking, Tim, could you please review AI Funnel? So that's what I'm gonna do today. You already see it in the background. So I'm gonna show you this product so that you can, uh, yeah, create your opinion based on what you see. Maybe you like it, maybe you don't like it. Uh, that's also possible, of course. But if you like what you see, uh, there is a link in the description of this video if you like to grab this. Uh, it will redirect you to my website where you're also gonna get some free upgrades if you pick this up through my link. So make sure to check out that link. All right, let's dive into this and let me show you what AI Funnels is all about. So right now I'm logged into the dashboard and here is where you have some statistics of your leads, of your landing pages created, the total templates that are in your account. And this account is front, uh, front end access. So everything that you're seeing here is what you will be getting when you purchase the front end. Now, you can start creating funnels by uh, two ways so here we have a landing page new landing page or you can click the launch funnel assistant now when i click this button the assistant will start speaking and i can create my page so let me do that and you can listen what she says hello i'm eva your virtual assistant i'll assist you through your journey inside ai funnels answer a few simple questions and i'll find you the best one you can use choose your end goal so here I need to fill out an answer here. So I can generate subscribers, sell physical products, lead generation, sell digital products, affiliate marketing. Well, you can see the choices that I can uh, make here. So let's say I wanna do lead generation, for example. Type. So here it says, choose your business type. So let's say I wanna do uh, online what business. What do you want to create today? And now I wanna create a lead page. Good choice, click me to initiate the search. So when I click this, it's going to show me the templates. While so, I search for your templates, I would like to tell something about me. Click so I'm going to skip to this. Results. I'm Eva, your AI representative. Click me to view results. And there are the results. So I stopped uh, because she's going to explain uh, blah, blah, blah. So here we have the templates that she found for me. Now, here are the it. templates you requested. Thank you. Click me to view results. Yeah, okay. I can preview the template, so I can click on preview here, and that will open the template for me in a new page where I can see the page that I can build. So this is a, one of the templates, a sign-up form here that you can choose from. So all these are the templates that you can choose from, from sign-up forms. Now, this is one way. Another way is simply by clicking on landing page. So in my opinion, I would be annoyed by using this launch funnel assistant because here you basically have the same options to choose whatever you like. So for example, uh, if we go to the AI funnels, you can also see there are opt-in pages in here or lead generation pages that are here, also lead, genera uh, lead generation pages. So you can simply take one of the templates, you click on builder, you give your uh, page a name. So I'm gonna call this drone page and I'm gonna click save and now start my builder. So this will bring you to the page builder uh, where you can start designing your pages, your funnels. Now, one of the things uh, which, I, which doesn't make sense to me is that this is called AI Funnels, but it only has two pages here. It says main page and a thank you page. Now the thank you page is when you have a sign up form, it will redirect them to the thank you page. When you click on thank you page, uh, you can design the thank you page here. It says thanks for buying. So on the main page, you can start designing. Now this is the page builder and it's being built out of blocks as you can see here. Now. At the right side here at the top, when you click this little icon, you can add columns here, images, text sections, sliders, videos, button links, countdowns, links, icons, uh, pay payment options in here uh, like PayPal and Stripe. Uh, and I think this is one of the upgrades if you want to add actual products inside of this funnel builder. Uh, but when you scroll down here, you can see all the template blocks that you can use. So there are many template blocks that you can choose from, as you can see here. Uh, I can scroll and scroll and scroll. And these are all pre-made blocks for you. So for example, if you want to have a sign up form here, uh, you can simply drag this and drop this into the builder here. And now it has added this block to your page. Now, maybe you're wondering, uh, why is it called AI Funnels? Well, 
when you click on a text uh, element in here, you can see that it says generate with AI. So when you click on here, it opens this window where you can choose whatever you would like to generate. So here it says headline, subheadline, feature, or describe. So here it says the ultra portable drone for the best video. So if you like to generate other titles, you can click on generate here. And then it will start generating other titles for you. So it suggests other titles for you. And basically done, done with ChatGPT inside of your funnel builder. So here it says uh, a long story. So probably I didn't click on the headline here. So I can use this. But I can also say, let me copy this just to be sure. Click on headline. Oh, it says now write headline about the ultra portable drone for the best videos. When I click on generate, it's going to regenerate the title. As you can see, unleash your creativity with the ultimate ultra portable drone for stunning videos. And if I like to generate again, I simply click on generate again, and it will generate another headline. Capture stunning videos on the go with the game changing ultra portable drone. So if I like to use this one, I click on use. And now you can see that it's been added in here. Now the same thing, I can do the same thing for the description here. I can click on generate with AI. And basically I can say, I wanna have a subline about, and then I can paste what I just copied in here uh, about the ultra, ultra portable drone for the best video. So I'm gonna click on generate. And now it's going to generate a sub line, or maybe I want to do features or I want to describe about this product. And if I want to do a description, uh, describe in short, maybe this helps in short, basically you can give the commands to chat GPT in here. Uh, so I'm going to click on generate and now it's going to generate an answer for me. Uh, the ultimate drone, blah, 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 lightweight. And now I can use this part, for example, use this, and this will be added in here. So it's going to write this for you on the fly. And this is how you build your pages. So basically you go to these tabs in here, you choose the blocks that you would like to use. So if you want to use another block here, so let's say um, you want to do, you want to show multiple drones, you can simply drag and drop this block in here. Uh, and here you can, redirect to your blogs, for example. Here you can see it. this is a complete blog uh, where you can edit these images. So when you double click, you can upload your own images. If you like to hide these lines, you can do that as well. Personally, I prefer that because this is a way cleaner page, as you can see. Uh, and here you can modify everything. So when I go to this again, you can generate everything with AI, as you can see. Uh, I can go down here, I can click on this, generate with AI. So basically everything on your page can be generated with AI. And if you like to add extra elements to your page, you simply go to here. If you wanna do a text section, you simply drag this and drop this into your page builder. Now, as you can see, this is all black uh, and it's, here, when I go to the right side, you have all the options. So when I go to typography here, I can say I want to have, for example, Arial Black, and I want to have the font color to be blue here, insert title. So uh, I think I added the title instead of a text element, uh, but you can basically change everything. So let me try it again. No, this is a text element. So probably this is, is uh, greater in here. So this is text, but it's already big. So I should say the font is light and then the pixels should be, for example, 18 pixels. Uh, and now it's better as you can see in here. So you can change everything in here. You can start typing, you can generate with IA, uh, AI again. And this way you can start designing your pages. Now I have to say, we'll be 100% 100% honest that this is not, the easiest builder. So if you, for example, add some blocks in here, sometimes it may be harder to configure your blocks. Uh, most of it also works here when you go to the layout with the settings like margin. Uh, if you're not really used to uh, working with margins and with paddings, this might be a little bit more difficult. So padding from the top, for example, that's the inner side here from the top and margin is always from uh, the top outside of a block, for example. So you can design that in here, like the paddings, you need to do that manually, so it's not dragging and dropping. Uh, and sometimes you need to, yeah, really look into it, how to change some parts. And that's uh, why I recommend if you get this, uh, that you take these pre-custom blocks that you can simply drag and drop here uh, inside of your builder. Now, once you're done, you can always preview your site in here. Uh, you can see this is the preview of the of the site that we just created. 
and here we click on going back. Now we can also design this for iPad and mobile device. So when I go to mobile device, I can change everything in here. So for example, now this text is black. I can also say, I wanna have this text, for example, I wanna have this text to be blue here and I wanna have this uh, blue as well. Uh, or white and then want to go back here and and I change for example here the font size when I make this eight pixels for example it's very tiny uh, but when I go back to my normal screen you can see the colors are still the other colors so you can design this also the font sizes the font colors etc based on the device that you're designing it for so that makes it pretty cool um, like I said there are two pages for each funnel uh, that's the part that does not really make sense to me. Uh, yeah, but besides that, you can see it's uh, it's also easy to build your pages. Now, once you're done, don't forget to save your page and then you can also publish your page in here. So here it says drone page. This is your page. You can add your favicon. When you want to publish the page, click on publish. Uh, then you can go to your domain here. Uh, it says the option custom domain. Honestly, I haven't looked into this. Uh, yet where to configure this maybe it's in the settings uh, let me quickly look at this i'm not able to go here we'll check this a little later um so let's say you want to use their domain it will be aifunnels.in uh, then you can change the name in here so you can say drones123 for example um, or your custom domain um, don't forget to hit save. You can change the SEO settings in here, like the SEO title, description, uh, keywords, social title, and also what's being shown when you share this page on social media, uh, your forms in here, uh, and the integrations uh, here. Uh, if you wanna set up your integrations, you need to do that through the left menu here, autoresponders, uh, payment system. So you could uh, redirect to a uh, URL or to the default thank you page. So the default thank you page, I showed you that. And you have also custom codes in here that you can add to your page. So if you like to have a pop-up, uh, I'm also giving one of the bonuses that gives you a real cool lead builder, uh, lead building system that you can add here to the header and then it will work on your AI funnels account. Uh, simply hit save and once done you go to your landing pages in here uh, and let's see here when we go to this page this is the website that we just created uh, with AI funnel builder so the AI part is where it's going to um, write the content for you based on your input so this is how you have your pages inside of the page you can go to your settings again if you want to change the parts that we just changed uh, in here inside of the actions you can go to your leads that have been gathered on your page you can clone your pages which can also be very useful uh, for example like i said it has only two pages so if you want to create multiple steps pages you can clone this page and then you can redirect to the upsell page for example so you can say this is a drone page and then you can create your upsell page etc and you can link that uh, to the new pages now, like I said here, the autoresponder here, uh, you can connect these autoresponders to AI funnels. Uh, leads will be shown inside of the lead section in here. So when people fill out your forms, sign up forms, etc., they will be shown in here. Uh, there are also tutorials on the inside here. Um, where you can see how this builder works, how you can start working with this builder. Uh, and let me see if I can go here, uh, account settings. Let me see if here is payment settings. I don't know for sure where to set up a custom domain because it's set when we create to that you were able to set up your custom campaign. Let me go to my landing pages again, uh, to settings. Let me see for domain here, custom domain. Yeah, so probably here um, you can add your own uh, custom domain in here. So here you can set subdomain, custom domain here as your custom domain. And then you need to redirect this to, uh, to this value. So you will be able to add your custom domain, your own domain in here as well. So you don't see that this is AI funnels. Uh, and that's basically in a nutshell what AI funnels is all about. Uh, again, if you have any questions, make sure to ask them in the comments below. Also, hit a thumbs up if this video was useful to you. Uh, and yeah, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done yet. I do a lot of product reviews uh, similar to products like this. So uh, 
don't forget that notification bell to get notified. And again, if you're interested, check out the link in the description. You're going to get some extras if you get this through me. And uh, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Talk soon. Cheers.